fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. There aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Bruce Lee, ladies and gentlemen, Bruce Epping Lee. As usual, ready to battle as he tries to take home the title. striking in training, and I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet. Obviously, a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Head kick attempt with block. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Oh, heavy kick downstairs. Oh, huge Superman punch. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, it's stringing them together so effectively, never throwing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't take so many upside the head. Somebody going to sleep. Straight right hand now just misses. Nice job offensively as the strike lands clean. Now some separation from this clutch position. Another powerful kick there. A lot of value with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. A swing and a miss by Lee. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Do some work, guys. These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. Stuff to take down, no problem. Back to the jab now. Kick to the body now, that one will plan. 
So three minutes off the clock in our first round. Lee gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. Nice shot there by the champ. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following a game plan. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range on the feet. I mean, when you don't check, you're going to continue to get blasted with kicks. His opponent has not deterred him from keeping on throwing those kicks. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. All right, so there it is. Yet another strike to the body. Feels like that was what the game plan was rooted in coming in here tonight. Absolutely, John. And you could think that he's setting him up to go up top. Or, honestly, if he continues to land at this rate, at this target, he could finish him here. So I wouldn't change anything unless he makes you. Slips. Some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack. Not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now and he's starting to show itself. Oh, nice punishing kick to the body. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. You ready to fight? You ready? Round two here. All right, next round is underway, and somewhat surprisingly, he got out of that previous round without absorbing anything in terms of significant damage, despite the fact that his opponent was pretty offensive. His opponent was very active, but it seems as though he could see almost everything coming in his direction. He's so well-versed, he's so skilled in his defensive fighting that nothing is breaking his defenses. Exchange in the pocket here. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Well, the most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. And at times in the past, maybe you could say he's been a headhunter. But tonight, he has worked the body to great effect. And those are really starting to take their toll. Jab now again, the fighter evades. Work with that jab, jab lands. All right, so another nice strike to the thigh, some bruising starting to develop, and that could render his opponent a one-legged fighter here down the line. And it'll take some time. It'll take some time when you land it there. But trust me, when you can dead that leg with those leg kicks, you can really start to see your opponent having difficulties moving. Right now, we're at step one. Nice job by him defensively there. This pace is just absurd, and he has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater, punches and brushes. I mean, being there, watching Max Holloway do what he did was super impressive. So to even list this performance alongside that tells you how this guy is fighting tonight. Oh, another beautiful body shot there. You see the damage starting to accumulate. Maybe some defense would be wise at this point in the fight. I think so, John. You can't just get beat up to the body. 
it doesn't show itself right away. It takes time whenever you're beating somebody up from the body and working your way up to the head. But right now, we are starting to see the damage, and you see it not only in the body, but in the reactions of the opponent. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Ooh, sidekick, well timed there. Just missing on the high kick there. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kick that's leading the dance. Lee gets hit with a kick. You know, when guys start to tell you, kick me here again, they start to posture. That means that what you're doing is actually taking an effect on it. Bleeding now, nasty cut on his nose. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Lands to the body. 90 seconds to go in the round. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to absorb damage. Oh, got the kick to the head home there. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other DC. Yes, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. nose is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. All right, round three coming up next. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, the truck has produced some replays from that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the strike that opened up that cut on the bridge of his nose. It's nasty, and it's in a bad spot because the reality is when you can't breathe through your nose, you start to open your mouth. But the blood is dripping down into your mouth. How is he going to breathe in order to have a chance Good. to win this fight? All right, here we go with this third round of this championship fight. Good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times where they came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Just unable to quite find that range. Nice job blocking that punch. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice counter jab there. Just missed on the front kick there. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Lee's blocking well now. Nice job to protect that already damaged nose as he raises the goal. And that one certainly found the target. He's got to start moving. Oh, he's got to move good too. 
Oh, gotta keep pressing here. All right, so the upper leg kicks have been a big storyline in this fight, and you gotta think at some point he's gonna switch stances or make an adjustment, or he's gonna lose this fight. He's gotta do something, because right now what he's doing has not worked. It's very clear that they did not expect this as part of his opponent's game plan, and he's been a step behind the entire time. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head. Just that one appeared to stun him. Back to the feet. So pretty good recovery by the opponent after getting stunned pretty good. Oh, that doesn't get it. We pass the midpoint here of the fight. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. You gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Went for the inside leg kick. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Straight right hand, no good. Nice kick. Go after the class. End this fight. End it. Let's work, guys. Come on. Oh! Some real power shots here. Oh, nice chest. Oh! And that'll do it! Him, but for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight.